over to your rectangle tool. Okay, now if you click on over here, click on this part, and you can move and make this whatever size you want around your shape. And then go on your wherever, whatever shape you want to pick and so that you repeat and come up with a nice design that objects touch, overlap, and you can pick any one of these. But what you need to do is make sure that you're repeating um, uh, different sizes of shapes um, to create a nice design. But make sure your things touch or they can overlap and come up with a shape design that when you click on a shape and you go over here where it's on this line and you look at width, you can change that to different widths. So we're going to call this one 